Hello and welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. I don't see him arrested. Oh, oh. Sir, you're under arrest for complicity in the murder of Councillor Jake. Please follow me. What? That's insane. I would never. Sir, please come quietly, or I'll have to forcefully subdue you. Fine, fine. There's no need for that. But you must know I am an innocent man. Oh no, I cannot. Oh, I cannot interact with him. Oh, no! Upside is. We can now rob his place. Oh my god, yes. Give me that. <laughs> Take anything that isn't nailed down. Eh. He's an asshole, but I don't know if he was truly involved in the murder, you know, the string enthusiast. That's what I like to see. I like strings. Wait a minute, they walked into this room, but that doesn't lead anywhere. What? Um. What the heck is this? Apple? And a cup of water. Have we made a mistake? I mean, there is a jail in town somewhere. We can go there. Oh. <laughs> and we did interact with the corpses. But we didn't find anything suspicious in here. Like, a, I don't know. How do we go into Reginald's house? What's next? What are we doing next? Uh, missions. Cecile's mighty staff. Teleporter pyramids. Argus failed experiments. Filter the completed, please. Fabulous five into the dark. Argus told us there are more orcs to be found on the western beach near the entrance of an ill-omened cave. Oh, all right, we can do that. Also, we could also talk to the sailors. Oh no, did I... I went all the, the way back. Oh no, um, no. That's not the play. Tranquil beats, please. No, no, wait. Harbor. <laughs> not a, I'm an idiot. Okay. Let's go talk to the sailors. Tell them we found a job for them. Wait a minute. They're, they're not here. What? Ever hear about the time the captain took the Duchess of Feddle's carriage for the joyride? Ha! Now it ain't. He drove it straight to the pub and back. Sauce? Here in Sicil? Ah, of all that cursed hunks of rock to land on, Conrad chooses this one. Yeah, by the way, what do you know about the staff of Pergamon? Now that you mention it, I noticed Dietmar, a fellow merchant travelling with us, carrying a sealed box off the ship during the attack. At the time, I figured he was just escaping with his personal effects. But it could well have been that staff you're talking about. Do you know anything about a certain Dietmar? Well, sure, I saw him slip off the ship, but I haven't a clue where he could possibly be now. Captain Conrad's the man to ask for such matters. You got it. Where are the sailors? Conrad is the uh, one on the ship, right? Don't forget yeah, the the time he got have you found us a job yet? We'll take anything, really. Yeah. The Fabulous Five, eh? That sounds like just the right opportunity for three brawny buccaneers like us. We'll go right away. Thanks. You're welcome. See you later. That's another one for the books and an achievement I didn't have. Ahoy, sailor! Are you enjoying the fresh winds of Sicile? Oh, and don't forget the time he got caught passing a love note to the lizard councillor's wife. What do you know about the staff of Pergamon? Aye, that Cecil's worse than a rooster. Crowing all around town about matters he ought to know, I better kept quiet. 
Well, if you know about the staff, I suppose you also know it's gone without a trace. Not without a trace, sir. For my part, I haven't a clue where it could have gone. Overboard, stolen, or vanished into thin air. Though I'm quite eager to see it return. I've got a reputation to uphold, you know. Wouldn't hurt to ask some of my men. I tried myself. But sailors tend to be a bit tight-lipped when they're afraid of getting one another in some trouble. Seaman's code, you know. Not to rat out a fellow sailor. One of your men saw Dietmar make off with a package. What? That weasel has it for sure. But I'll tell you this. I didn't speak of that stuff to a soul on board. If he's the one who took it, he must have known it was on the ship before stepping foot on her decks. I'm sure he'll make a run for it, probably by boat. I'd look for him on an out-of-sight beach somewhere. He's probably there now, trying to launch a vessel in private. If he hasn't already escaped, that is. Oh, the beach is a long beach. Like he did say west uh, when it comes to the orcs. There's also a small island over there that I would like to investigate. I still don't know what to do with the play. Do we need to talk to Esmeralda? She is the only one in yellow, so perhaps we have to go back and talk to her once more. Let's go to the north gate. Damn, this... There is so much content <laughs> in this game. We've been here for like more than nine hours and I'm still doing things. And I'm not complaining because the writing is so good. I'm having a lovely time. So Esmeralda's place is... Uh, uh, is that the, the place? Yeah, that's the one. Okay. While we're doing that... Let's look at the missions. Filter completed. Fabulous five. Assure me, dear Septimus, that you haven't been. Oh, so Mayor Cecil has asked the Fabulous Five to destroy a rogue robot, so Cecil wants it done. Oh, but don't you worry. Okay, that complicates things because I like Cecil, the the, the mayor, the the deaf mayor. What if you were to be ambushed, caught unawares? Guys, can you please get a room? Jesus Christ. The hunter returns. I hope you are here to shop rather than sleuth. I've been told your husband collected something called Starstone. Care to elaborate? Starstone? I've never heard of such a thing. Dear Jake had a mineral collection, yes. As far as I knew, it was one of his pastimes, nothing more. Do you mean to imply he collected something dangerous? Something that may have gotten him into trouble? So, what piece of irrefutable evidence are you about to present me with this time? Here we go again. This love letter from Feral seems kind of uh, incriminating. Oh, don't put stock in the hastily scribbled words of a lovelorn fool. This letter, it was a show of passion. A poorly worded passion I did not echo in the least. The Duke, he's like a spoiled child. He's not a man. He's not like Septimus. Yeah, I mean, actually, I feel like she is just a flirt. She's just flirting with pretty much everybody. She's not a slut. But, you know, perhaps she didn't do it. She's innocent. I feel like... I get the feeling that Evelyn is the one behind it because she was the one, along with the mortician, who saw the body of Jake, but the wife doesn't know anything about that. We found so much evidence against you, had you not better confess. But all of it is circumstantial. I have a perfectly logical explanation for every piece of so-called evidence against me, and yet you've been trailing me like a bloodhound. People seem to want to believe I am guilty, so let me tell you something I've been keeping to myself. Perhaps it may yet lead to the true culprit. Go ahead. Over the last few months, Jake grew distant. Distant and dark, somehow. Something in him changed. I can't quite put my finger on it, but he was no longer the gentle man he used to be. In fact, he scared me. We did hear that he was seen with a, a woman with white hair. So, I have suspicions that he was cheating on his wife as well? It all began the day he met Evelyn, 
Master Thelion's apprentice. There we go. She healed him of what we all believe to be a fatal wound he suffered hunting boars. I think he became obsessed by her. Or obsessed by the secrets I just know she holds. Talk to this woman. There is more to her than meets the eye. Nice. Nice. And she is involved with these healing stones, if you know what I mean. Let's go talk to her again. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if she belongs to that sect. You know, to those who worship a goddess without name and practice rituals of blood. Tell me more about her. I never liked her from the moment I met her. Men cannot see past her beauty, but I have gazed her in the eye and it was death that leered back at me. She hails from Silver Glen. A village in the forest, north of Sysil. How she made it past the undead without a legion escort, I'll never know. Though I can hazard an eerie guess. Hmm, fair point. If anyone killed my Jake, it must be her. She had her claws in him for many long months, and finally she must have cut too deeply. I don't know if she killed him, but she's definitely involved. You're not out of the suspect list, lady. You're still on it. Very much so. But Evelyn has some explaining to do. Let's go back. Evelyn is... Uh, Ev Evelyn is where? Cook's house. Esmeralda's shop. The clinic, the clinic. Oh, I'm... I'm <laughs> going the wrong way. Is this the one? This is the one. Cool. Yeah, perhaps we should, like, use the open door. Duh. And I'll have another look at the, at the play before we give up on that quest, because I'm intrigued. I wanna know what's in that house. Where the heck is Evelyn? Where is she? To what do I owe the repeated pleasure, Source Hunter? Let's discuss the patients Evelyn was attending to. The world belongs to the young, they say, and Boris will live to take his peace. Thank you for your help in this matter. Far be it from her to tell her master what in the seventh name she's up to. The girl flew from here like she just heard the location of the Philosopher's Stone. Oh. She even left her pouch unattended in the next room. Most unlike her, to be sure. What about her pouch? She usually keeps it within sight at all times. Very strange she'd leave it behind. It's in the next room if you'd like to take a look. What do you think she would have run to? I'd try her house, for starters. It's not far from here. I'll mark the location on your map. But it's lo Do you have the key? The next room. Why is the game even darker now? Um, please. Oh, Jesus. Oh. A lot better, I suppose. I mean, the changes didn't register. Uh, Evelyn's backpack. But this is stealing! Oh. Thank the gods. Thank the gods for this. Why can't I dig this up? Oh, the outside is so much brighter now, though. <laughs> I don't know if I like this. Hey, guys, can we, like, open this door instead of going all around? Simple as that. This is so weird to me. We are not allowed to dig this up anymore. Why? I don't think this is the house we're looking for, right? No. Evelyn's house is... This. You know what? I think it's way too bright right now. Right there. Mayhaps. Yes. 
Secrets of the Scroll, Volume 1. Sort by type. Got some uh, new books in here I would like to read. Homemade Dagger. Improved Metal Shield. Homemade Sword. We've done the fluids, the string enthusiast. We got debuff strength potion. And that is all. Secure lockbox. Be taking the empty cups because Yeah. Not even worth the rummaging. Letter from the conduit. And curious parchment. Orders. Shade of paper. Is this... No, no, no. This is uh, an empty piece of paper. Curious parchment. Reanimation serum. Boil the last mint sprouts of the season within a sludge made of one part crow's eye jelly to four parts sour holy water. Add the tear of a blind beetle and let stand for two moons. There are two hastily scribbled notes at the bottom of the parchment. The first reads, King Crab Inn, Mortician, Evening. The second reads, Esmeralda, Evening, Visit. Huh. Evelyn, tea tells me the hour is nigh. The king will leave again. When the stone is secured, I will be unstoppable. Surely you've heard about my sister already? Gone. Forever, there is no little. There is so little that stands in our way now. Redouble your devotion, for the rewards are inconceivable. We shall meet again soon. Signed, the conduit. Through blood, her powers flows. Through blood, her triumphs grows. Uh, we didn't get any out of this. Like it's not really a clue. Another piece of trash. I'll take it. Oh, wooden figurine. You can take that. You can take that. I'll grab the rest. Secure lockbox. Is, is that what? That's a test. Yeah, well. Yoink. I'll take the pot. Evelyn's diary. I bet that's important. Reveal spell. Curious glow, nearly indiscernible to the eye, emanates from this parchment. Spotless save a series of measured words. Inscribed by a careful hand. Reveal spell. What? Something happened. We who seek this hidden place, the conduit keep. We who dare to speak the spell, the goddess fear. We who step through yonder gate, the hunters hate. I mustn't have used it correctly. I read it. We also got a book. September 15. Once the Etma arrives with a staff, I will be utterly unstoppable. How pleased the conduit will be. How great the rewards she'll grant once she sees the evidence of my dedication. The Counselor will be of no concern to her now. I have taken the necessary precautions to disguise the Northwest Beach Lair from prying eyes so that only those with knowledge of the spell may enter. I do say Arahu's little terror taking control of the northern path, leading there was quite the unexpected boon. Few are the fools who will face that monstrosity, and my lair will remain undisturbed. May the goddess guide me. Octavianus I. I've warned that the conduit has done away with the so-called White Witch. Good riddance. She haunts Lusula Forest like an eel phantom, wailing over the natural order. Without her meddling, the strong will rise and the weak will fall, as it's their nature. The Immaculate Way will flourish. So, she's got a lair on the beach, does she? Yes. Perhaps that's where she's stashed Jake's body. Northwest Beach Lair from Prying Eyes, Northwest. Okay, we have a location to uh, to look into now. 
Last but not least, oh my god, the game is still so bright, my eyeballs hurt. We did level up, however, let's uh, have a look see here. I will bring your perception up by one bit, and then, let's see, skills, geomancer. You're a geomancer? Witchcraft? Uh, personality, nasty deeds. I'm thinking of giving her lore master so she can identify things and we can recruit either uh, the, the other source hunter or the mage or the wizard guy we found in the library. But do I need a lore master one or a lore master two? We can do bartering. There we go. Oh, everybody leveled up. How do I level up my man at arms? Maybe he's not ready yet. Um. Geomancer. I really want to level this up. Allows you to learn and use three novice adept and master man at arm skills. So we cannot level this up any further, I suppose. Scoundrel skills. We could do pyro on him, which is stupid if you think about it. But I will give you... Uh, is it constitution? Vitality and maximum number of action points. Yes. One extra there. Bartering. He also has bar bartering and leadership, so... Uh, he's got telekinesis. Why? Can move items from a distance. I mean, yeah. We need that. And you, sir... You, with your nasty deeds. Oh, I cannot do lockpicking? Wait, you, you didn't level up? Ah, there we go. Lore Master. I can give him Lore Master instead. Scoundrel. Marksman. Give you one on speed. And yeah, you can have one lore master. Let's start working towards that. Sounds like a good deal to me. She didn't level up. Oh, she leveled up before anybody else. Okay. God, it's so bright. And we are going... As a matter of fact, it's pretty close, I think. Oh, I didn't take these! Hello! Bah! If you think black sheep are weird, try weird sheep! <laughs> I think they're cute. Reginald's spare key? Why, hello there! Why would you put it inside a barrel? Oh, Reginald, is this your house by any chance? No, this is not his house. But his house has to be close. <laughs> Come on, chop chop. Oh my, yes, we found his house. This is where we're bringing the, the head if we can ever take it. I was really hoping to find something better. Same here, girl. But beggars cannot be choosers. Oh, no. Um, I see scratches on the floor. <gasps> it's the one with the carpet. Oh, my God, yes. Oh. We 
We will need to come back to this because I need to have the head with me. Juggling oranges. What? I should say, there might be traps down here. Juggling maize, juggling apples. Reginald's diary. I guess someone else got here first. One man's trash is another man's trash. Fake arrows. Fair daggers. Take the diary. Ooh. Ooh, indeed. Fortunate day. A trip down to the beaches of the Black Cove yielded a wonderful treasure. A talking head. Katarina says it is a stuff of sauce, but how can such a silly gag be the product of dark magic? It insists its name is Nick, but I think I'll call it Stefan. Now there's a name with a flair for the showman about it. When luck have it, the curio knows a story or two already. And what a voice! My show will be the most profitable at the fair. I fairly buzz with joy when I think of the sad sack look on Cedric's face. Hmm. That was a lot of XP, dude. I'll take it. So now we know the story. There's nothing else in here, I don't think. No secret compartments. We know the truth. We could either confront Reginald, I think, or... I still want to steal the head. There's gotta be a way to do it. Fantastic. Let's try to talk to him first. Fantastic. I think, a king. The great Sigurd and his rainbow of war machines. <laughs> but for more, I see! Well, like, why do I care what tall tales you've heard about Stefan? No. We are uh, not allowed to talk to him. We'll just have to think of something more clever than daylight robbery. What should we do next? I haven't talked to, to the dog in quite some time. Maybe we should uh, pay a visit to the pupper. Whose house is this? I'll take the broom. Sure. I forgot about it. Wait, I'm not allowed to take... There we go. This is the uh, Esmeraldas. Yes. Cecil's office. What? Oh, it's you! What news? Hmm. Oh yeah, I don't think we've talked about this. I've joined the Fabulous Five. Let's discuss the assignment they gave me. Oh yes, the Fabulous Five. Aren't they simply fantastic? I'm sure they'll get the job done in no time, especially with your expert hand lent to their cause. That machine Ahu built is an abomination. It must be stopped at all costs. I bet the wizard himself could provide some advice regarding how to destroy it. He's the mad scientist who crafted it after all. Yeah, we talked to him already. Nothing you there either. Where's the dog? Do 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 do. Be do be dee dee be be. It's been so long since we've been in the uh, in the cemetery, and we haven't dug up this one just yet. And I want to know what's underneath. Might be treasures. Might be secrets. Gee, wow, that dead sheep smells pretty great. I mean, wow. <laughs> but it's nothing compared to Jake. Seems like some mutt is marking my territory. This isn't your master, boy. Someone stole Jake? Jake stole my ball once, <laughs> the and then he threw it far, and I went, and I got it. <laughs> and Jake was awesome. <laughs> Listen, 
if you go around town and, and find someone who you think might have done it, bring me a really stinky something of theirs. And I'll see if I can smell Jake on it. An awesome smell. I couldn't mistake it. Something very stinky. I just happened to <clears throat> wear a, um, very stinky panties. Rest in peace, I didn't even bother washing them. I don't want to talk about it. Do you think you could smell whoever killed Jake? Esmeralda? Ugh, terrible smell. Like flowers and soap. Not awesome. Ugh, hated her. <laughs> Aureus is kind of awesome. Evelyn, too. They both have a, a sweaty, dead thingy smell. Cecil, he's all right, I guess. Mostly, he smells like old books, which is neither awesome nor non-awesome. Bring me anything of theirs, and I'll be able to tell you if I can sniff out Jake's smell on them. <laughs> Murphy's best boy. Jake has the best smell. I'd know it anywhere. Did, did you find something for me to stick my nose into? What are we giving the dog to smell right now? We have two things. Rest in Both of them are dying. underwear? Oh god. Uh, here, smell this. It belonged to... Says, I don't know what it is. I've heard people say that politicians stink. <laughs> Give me a whiff, and I'll be able to tell you if it's a Jake kind of stink. Whoa, 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 whoa. what happened to the dialogue no, here? No, <clears throat> not him. No scent of Jake whatsoever. Esmeralda? Jake was awesome, and she didn't like Jake. So I'm pretty sure she's the worst thing that ever lived. Let me get a whiff. Oh! Take this away. It smells like every rich man in town except Jake. No, there's definitely not a hint of Jake here. Oh my god. How many people did she sleep? Jesus Christ, Esmeralda. Come with us. You can help us sniff out the guilty party. Join you? No way. I mean, you smell pretty great. Even better than the dumpster behind the butcher's house. <laughs> the town is full of scary stuff like, like body snatchers and, uh, and bathtubs. Without my best friend, the most awesome Jake ever, here to protect me, I'd rather stay far away. Just bring those smelly items to me here. Boom! If I ever find out who killed Jake, <laughs> the most awesome Jake who ever jaked, I'll... The most awesome Jake who ever jaked. I love this dog. Peace be with you, traveler. May your lost love. One day I will dig this up, girl. But that day is not today. So what are we doing now? Um, we didn't get anything out of the dog. I think we just get got a little bit of XP. But what am I gonna do with the head? Oh no. Do we have a clue on the... Wait, a mysterious murder. Why the... It's willing to be able to help us find his master's murder. Should we find any particular odorous items belonging to any suspects, he'll be able to tell whether or not they've been in contact with Jake recently. But we didn't find anything of Evelyn's. We have her diary, but that doesn't help us any. But we have a way to find Evelyn because we have the uh, the revealing scroll, which I should probably put in my inventory for easy use later. To try and find the the opening. So now I'm clueless. How do we get to uh, to Nick to the uh, the headless thingy? Is this uh, Cecil's office? Yes. Cook's house. We could talk to our, our, our Rurios again. And then check the play once more. Maybe there's something we haven't done. Listen, I'm not an actor, okay? And I did this with my brother. Oh, this is the cook's house, right? Yeah. Wait, who, who's this? Oh, he's yellow, so perhaps we, we do need to talk to him. Again. 
It sounds zangy. What happened? Yes? Discovered anything? The subject of Jake's corpse. It was stolen? We Can't already know that. Yes, yes. Well, I assume it hasn't crawled back to its grave. So have you found any suspect? Certain Evelyn has been mentioned. What is in her diary certainly seems to implicate she dabbles in sorcery. Well, you're supposed to be the sauce hunter, aren't you? Go hunt some sauce! In regards to Jake's wife, Esmeralda... Well, have you found any incriminating evidence against her? If so, let's have it! Just this letter, I guess. Hmm... The knife, the book, the letter... They seem harmless enough by themselves, but in conjunction they do paint a pretty grim picture. Fine then. If you're certain she did it, then I shall have Esmeralda arrested. Your responsibility, Source Hunter. Surely you have exhausted all the evidence that was to be found, no? A good bloodhound knows when the trail has gone cold. So be a good dog now, won't you? No, uh, no more arrests for the time being. Evelyn fleed the place, so she is our prime suspect, and for a good reason. Source Hunter, a sight for sore eyes indeed. Nice to see. Oh, that's a that's a locked door right there. Okay, ignore that. Keep walking. Does he have to be involved, Cedric? Did we did we pay him to do anything here? Oh yeah. Can we pay him to do the play himself? Just waiting for his big day do. Ah, a familiar. F it seems even my and e I don't know how. Don't pity me when Reginald. No, nothing you there. What is it this time? Katarina, tell me when you're ready to begin, and I'll. Sh Enjoying the fair, aren't you? Of course you are. As I said, duh! Speak to Master Chaucer if you're ready for your debut. Well, I've a no. Fantastic! Bravo! Honestly, I have no clue how to do this. Evelyn's secret lair and strange cave. Um, I'm ready to go outside actually again. Let's go to the north gate. Oh, that's that's a cock. Wait, 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 wait. Chicken. Liberty, equality, and brotherhood for all will turn the wicked cleaver of decapitation upon you. Revolution is coming. A <laughs> French rooster. Oh boy, I love that. That was a good touch. Right, there's no door here, really? You will make me walk all the way? Oh. Jesus Christ, game. Let's see what we're playing with here. This guy wants to arrest somebody? Wh what is this over here? Have we been here? I don't think I have. Wh what is this building? Oh no, and I just left that neighborhood. God damn it. I'm not... I, I think it's closed off because there's a gate there so we cannot go either way. Reginald's house. And the king crab. Okay, we're very close to the king crab. We'll have a last look in there. If there is someone else we can talk to. 
Waitress. Who is Anna again? Oh, come, darling, don't dither. You must speak with Mendius and join the Fabulous Five immediately. I so you've joined up. You've sworn to share in our adversity and our bounty alike. Oh, you've made my heart sore. I can finally offer you our finest adventuring equipment at fantastic in-house rates. Come now, let's trade. Oh, but so that's what she does. To find yourself a member of a team so widely renowned for its valor and skill. And you must be even more curious about how you yourself can suit up to face such enemies as a member of the Fabulous Five must face. Well, never fear. I have everything you need. You did say fair prices. How fair are we talking? Uh, they're okay, I guess. She's got a lot of muns. And I am going to take these muns. Yes. <laughs> a fork. A pot. You. I think she's broke at the moment. Don't you want to venture forth hand in hand, like you said? Ah, oh, darling. That was so long ago now. Who can remember who said what after all this time? What matters is the here and now. And in this moment, I promise to give you the best deals on adventuring equipment you'll find in all Cyseal. Not interested. Well, you are a member of the eminent Fabulous Five, after all. Nope. Come now, Alistair. Sure. Really now? I can't afford to indulge in chit-chat with my legion of followers. Even a star needs a few moments to himself. Novak is also it's part you. of the Fabulous Five, Just right? the person to answer a question that's been knocking around my mind since our first meeting. Now then. Zimbladorix! Zat! Ha! Quite under my spell, aren't you? Yes, my infriending charm never fails. Excuse me? Me? You mean you don't recognize me? Well, you must live under a very large, very heavy rock, for I'm the finest wizard in Rivellon. Strange. I've never heard of you. Yes, that is strange. Strange indeed. But it's a strange world we live in, isn't it? A strange and magical world, full of wonders and regionis regentum. And what was that supposed to accomplish, to Harry Potter? Oh, you'll find out. <laughs> you'll find out indeed. If I'm as good as they say I am, I am, you'll have sprouted a pair of long purple ears in the next hour. Ah, how I do love a tasty aubergine in summertime. A fucking weirdo. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Who is Francis? Glorious to see you once more, fair friend. I hope you've given some thought to my revelation. I think only of your eternal soul, after all. Tell me more about this conduit. She came from all okay, yeah? she uh -huh. shows that Inge go on the path to the Yeah, Evelyn was into that stuff. And you saw what happened. Fish vendor. Join the spud club if you got an eye for farm potatoes. Tall Sounds good. Stick, wing of worm, Let's be on our way. I think we're done. Roa. Who is Roa? That thief is free for now. But I wonder how long it'll be until his growling belly seduces him back onto the crooked path. What did you think of the thief? Thank you for making that would-be thief see reason. I only hope your instruction lasts. The last thing the plagued people of Cyseal need is a thief among them. Okay. It seems. Outside we go once more. I hope I stay outside a little bit longer than last time. 
I got chicken because I got attacked the moment we walked outside the the doors, the gates of Sicil. No, not this way, this way. Excellent. Let's keep it that way. It's heating up. Things it's I didn't steal. The city is to danger. Be careful, source hunter. Oh, I will be. Mark my words. Oh. Why does the weather change drastically the moment we walk outside? What gives? No, this is not the, the book I just picked up. This is the book I just picked up? No? This? Which, which volume was it? Three? This one. There we go. Handcrafted boots. Out for an adventure. Um. To the west. Scary noises. I'm I'm scared. Splitting. Mo who who dropped this here? I'll I'll take it. Sure. Thankfully, we made some room in my inventory now. I don't want to step on that, but uh, one of them will watch. They didn't! Amazing. I see you little fuckers. Oh god, there's so many of them. I should really look my inventory before I do anything crazy here. You take this. Actually, you know what? No, you. You take this. Learn the skill. Expert marksman. Mmm. Good stuff. Divine light skill book. Can you learn that, sir? I don't think he can learn anything at the moment. He, he needs to be of higher level or whatever. Does anybody have any ammo? Plus one due to level difference, yeah. We need to level up again for that one. Bear hammer. Corroded ring that does nothing at all. Um, nothing great here. How about boots? Let's see here. Boots are not great, I could have sold this stuff. We have a lot to uh, identify. Let's start the dance. Not equip, identify. So many things, Jesus. Leather armor of vitality. You might need that. Initiative, movement. Absolutely. What else is there? Eleven boots. Extra bartering. My boots are fifteen. His boots are 17. Gets extra bartering out of these. This is a blue. Ooh, this one's a bad boy. Yes, absolutely. Gives him some extra vitality as well. Good stuff. Uh, you're not wearing any of that. Oh, goddamn. I didn't bring the mage. I wanted to bring the wizard. Extra pickpocketing, so that goes to you, sir. Yes. Already using two daggers there. Uh, dexterity. Currently using... Okay. Reflect 10% of melee damage as fire damage. I'll use that, sure. And he can have this... I mean, no, he is taking 
uh, melee damage because he's going into everybody's face, right? So he will have the dexterity amulet. Oh, I didn't identify this one. One strength and poison resistance goes to this bad boy. Fire resistance, uh, telek oh, he, he does have telekinesis, right? But I want the strength. Unlock skill. Fire resistance. I don't really need strength on, uh, on anybody else, but you don't have any ring, so here you go, for now. Poison resistance and telekinesis. Okay, fine. Wait a minute, what is this? Armor and... What is this part of the armor? Are we missing something here? Some staves... I think this is all the stuff. Cool. Okay. I'm still freaking terrified. I'm not a huge fan of uh, Berdotter. She's cute and whatnot, but I say we go grab the the wizard from the library, which is, uh, as a matter of fact, right here, just around the corner. Oh, not not in here, no. Uh, I really need to remove these. Gotta sell some garbage as well. We have so many things we're not using. Is anybody who's not wearing a helmet you? You do. You know, you can have it. There you go, girl. It's not great, but it's better than nothing. Oh, we, we made it in already. Bear daughter, show me the goods. How can I move things fast from one player to another? Resurrection scrolls? I don't need to give you any of that stuff, do I? Uh, no, I will. Encyclopedia Demonium. I know it by heart. There's so many things. There's gotta be a way, an, an easier way, to uh, transfer to transfer for one player to another. We're almost done. Okay, is that all? That's all the stuff. Good. Bear daughter. We must part ways. Heard any good tape if you say so, sir. See ya. Okay. Where's the wizard? The source hunter. Have you come to your senses? Have you yes, so why would you want mind? to join forces? Why? Simply because you hunt source and I, Jehan, hunt demons. You are aware, of course, that quite often both of these pests frequent the same shadowy pools of infamy. Now. I hate what I hunt, but I respect its cunning. Should I not, I'd have been decimated body and soul long since. This is a sentiment I'm quite certain you must recognize. Let there be strength in cunning, yes, but also in numbers. The calculus of wizardry I offer you, the might of the magician's mastermind. Okay, let's go. On one condition. That on our joint travels, we will never deal with demonic entities, no matter how tempting their propositions. Give me your word on this, and I'll weave you spells. You got it. Good. Esmeralda does have a propensity Agreed. For all things. Nothing good ever came from bargaining with those devils anyway. Most gratifying. I see you are firm of purpose and thereby ready to descend. Descend into the madness that is sorcery, into the depths where demons dance. Gladly shall I follow you into the abyss. Onward, blood and triumph await. 
Out of curiosity, can I kick out I think these books legs in the night. my bo- No. These two main characters have to stay in a party. We cannot kick out anybody. As for you, my boy, your intelligence, I mean, and constitution would be nice if it was a little higher. There we go. And also... Volume two. Skills. Witchcraft. Why don't you have witchcraft? I mean, now you do. Boom. He's a grumpy old man. I can tell you that much. Also, his inventory is empty. And he's level 4. Let's go, boys. All the way back again. I'm sorry. I, oh, I keep forgetting. There, there has to be an easier way to move from one place to another without doing that again. Do, 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 do. And as... Uh, no, I, I shouldn't cast any spells at the moment. You know what we should have done? We should have left one behind with uh, a pyramid. And another one... Who, who has the pyramids at the moment? Who is the keeper of the pyramids? So I'm gonna leave one person behind next time we do this. There you go, buddy. So we want to have to travel from point A to point B. Watch as they step into the pool of garbage. No, they're good. Perhaps we should heal you before we begin, my guy. Why are you so hurt? We're not done yet. I have things in my pockets that you should have. I have magics. And I didn't sell those. I'm so happy I didn't. I should give you this, and this, and the robes, and another, and, uh, is that all? Oh, I have another one. We run out of rings at this point, I gotta get some more. Let's see what we got here. He's using a pretty interesting quarter stuff. Turns out that it's a... Can I wear this? Yes. Turns out that it's a way better... What, what is this slot here? What, what does it serve? What purpose does it serve? Oh. I didn't notice... Wait, that that's a belt? I think those were his clothes. This is fire. This is the one... No. This is not the one I'm using. Gives him 7 HP, 15% chance to set crippled status for 3 turns. Oh, you know? But this is a water staff. What is the other one? Oh, both are water staves. And then we have the fire staff. I'll play with this one a little bit. Quite happy with those. I believe we are ready to proceed. Mayhaps we should like sneak. Let's go, boys. There are so many of them. Archers. Step there, okay. We cannot set warm because everything is burning. Well, I, I didn't move. I, I didn't move. Come hasten for a short while, cloak and dagger. Walk in shadows. Invisible. Oh, I love it. Now, a question for everybody. If I walk 
past them in this form? Do they see me? The answer is no. Now, going in there is a questionable decision. I say I power myself up and wait for someone to walk outside. I'm not gonna take any action right now. Oh. What? Wh why would you do that? Well, at least he's coming outside. He's not getting plagued, I see. Rain, regeneration, a bitter cold. I think we can freeze them, right? Mayhaps. Yes, beautiful. Wizards are cool in this game. They're so freaking... Oh, there's a zombie as well? You know what's upsetting? That we have to wrap it up pretty soon and it sucks. I, I do have the backstab. I, I really do. Wait, I don't? What? Why? I have lacerate. Does that count? Target is too far. Can I like stab him from behind? That's the plan. I got spider, bitch! And it's wet and ready for action. No more action points. Uh, let's boop him. Noise. See, no more action points here. What is this? <gasps> we have teleportation? Oh my god. That's amazing. One down. <gasps> he dropped something. What's this? Regeneration scroll. Awesome. Shocking touch. Uh, are you going to be one of my favorite characters, uh, Jahan? Go for the eyes, boo! Go for the eyes! What do you think you're going? Ow. Fast track. Just keep you close by for anybody who walks past this point. I don't want you to go in there. Teleport away, leaving behind a smoke screen. No, we're good here. We're good. This is not going to hit. There's a wall there, girl. There's a wall. And you don't have sufficient AP to do anything, so... Wait for it. Okay, my boy can stand here. What? Is there, there's someone behind... Did I forget about you, you you little shit? Can we reach? Shocking touch. Target is too far. Good accuracy on that one. Weak! Those misses though. They're not helping anybody. Oh, the archer is coming back out. How dare! Hey, uh, I'm immune to poison because I'm already poisoned. Slapping my my spider. What is wrong with you? Uh, you 
can grab that. Avatar of Frost Scroll. That was a nice shot. Can we get another one in? Not enough AP. Son of a bitch. I can heal my boy though. And move to the next target. 75 76%! Spidey boy, where are you going? Why did, why did you move around? How did you miss a 76%? Oh, this is XCOM all over again, I swear to god. Let's top it off. And do... Bleeds bolts. Yes. You're stunned! It is true indeed. Oh no, my spidey boy. They will have to come outside, right? Surely. There he comes. We need to take this guy from afar. Is he healing? Fast track. Lacerate his butt. Oh, he's not close enough to me. Cloak and dagger. I could go. Target is blocked. I don't want to be any anywhere near this thing. This thing hurts. It's going to ruin my day. I'll, I'll just wait here, I guess. No actions taken. Oh wow, that was huge, girl. I take back everything bad I said about you. Slap his ass. Or his face. Same thing. And then... Uh, target is too far. I see. Very nice, boys. Very nice. I suppose this guy is not coming any closer to me. This will, though. Okay. It's time to take action. This will take 5 AP to get behind him, right? Right there. Doesn't he get a, an attack of opportunity? Oh, I'm poisoned. Fuck you. Can I get a hit on that guy? No, because the zombie is in the way. And I don't get to attack him twice. Again! N never mind! So, shocking touch. As this distance over here, uh, it takes two to move, or three, three AP to move here and two to move here. I'll bring you right there. And that should do it. The wizard is great! Zombie deaded, but now I must heal you. Become hastened for a short while. Okay, let's get you out of there. Can I feed you anything? <laughs> the whole pork. Wait, I, I can't eat? I don't have I don't have sufficient AP for that. Well, poopies. Bitch, I can reach you now. You can see uh, Ken, I believe, from here. 
Target is blocked. Well, that sucks. Stay here for a while. We're still poisoned. Can we cleanse this freaking area here? It's raining, so I don't think water does it. It doesn't change anything. We teleport. This guy. Here? Hello! <laughs> I'm glad I remember how this works. He seems confuzzled. Jesus Christ, dude! Oh my lord! No! Gotta get behind you. No, what are you doing, you damn ass? Oh my god. Heal him. And release the spider. Ah, oh. I'm burning! I, I can see it. I, I, I try to release the freaking... I should press the, the numbers on my keyboard and not with my fingies. Wait. Oh, it was... Yeah. Everybody's still alive? Does anybody else smell smoke? We are wet. We should be okay. Put that out. Oh, rain. Yes. Perfect moment to stop for the day. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Have fun, whatever you do. Take care of yourselves. And do not forget, keep on gaming. I will see you all next time.